All right. Uh, obviously, we're talking about, uh, you know, Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury yet again. I think this is obviously going to be a big topic of conversation up until it comes out on the 12th. And yes, folks, I'm buying the game. In fact, if you want to pre-order the game, I'll put an affiliate link down in the description uh, for that. Speaking of the description, down there we also have... Dun, da, 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 da. I don't know why I just did that. We're giving away a PlayStation 5, an Xbox Series X, or a Nintendo Switch. Uh, maybe even two of them if we somehow hit 70,000 subscribers this month, which I know that's like a big pipe dream. We're talking, you know, half a month or so to get 7,000 plus new subscribers. That's probably a little out of bounds here, but uh, we are giving away at least one anyways. Uh, there's information down in the description for that. Also in the pinned comment, if you just want to go straight to the comment section uh that being said we are talking about super mario 3d world plus bowser's fury again because it is now the best selling game on amazon and it's not even here yet it is far and away the best selling game it's not even close uh after nintendo just dominated amazon in 2020 it looks like it's continuing again let's take a look at the bestseller list so here's the amazon bestseller list specifically for video games obviously you have all these uh cards at the top that's pretty normal uh the eShop codes uh playstation codes xbox gift cards these those, those cards are always at the top of the bestseller list for the most part because people are buying you know thousands of those things a day uh why they buy them on amazon instead of just going directly through the shops i don't know maybe it's a trust thing because amazon is more trusted with people's cards uh than some of these other digital shops but uh, you'll see at number five here is Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury. Uh, you see some Roblox bucks. Roblox is huge, by the way. I don't know if people realize how big that game is. Uh, I think the company behind it just got valued at $6 billion just because of Roblox. It's insane. Uh, but Ring Fit Adventure here is the next uh, best-selling game. Not a surprise. After all, New Year's resolutions, everyone's trying to lose weight and work out and all that jazz. Switch is really popular. The workout game is going to be really popular. Uh, let's see, the little pro controller slipping in here. The glass protector on those new switches. The next game uh, coming on down here uh, technically is Minecraft for PC. Uh, but uh, if you want to go to, oh man, the Nintendo Switch. Woo, that Redbox version's hitting it hard. Uh, but then we got Just Dance as the next game. And then Animal Crossing. All Switch games, by the way. Oh, and by the way, not to be left out of the top five. Top six, technically, if you count Minecraft there, is Super Mario 3D All-Stars for Nintendo Switch. And then Breath of the Wild. I mean, look at this. It's it's like a sweep for Nintendo. Hyrule Warriors, Age of Calamity, Super Mario Party, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. You got Spider-Man in there finally for PlayStation 4. But yeah, it's a bit of a landslide at the moment. Uh, but yeah, it's all about Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury right now. And that shouldn't really be much of a surprise. Uh... It is the big game coming out. Although, it's kind of interesting because there are other games coming out for, say, PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X, but so few people own those systems that it's hard to see sales for the games for those systems being super high for probably this first year. Uh, we'll see. I know, obviously, Miles Morales did well, but that was a cross-platform game. I haven't heard anything about Demon Souls, which was PlayStation 5 exclusive, actually performing well uh and obviously when it comes to microsoft's games because of game pass the sales are always going to be a bit lower than they uh would have been before game pass because i mean if you own an xbox and don't have game pass i don't know what the hell you're doing with yourself uh that being said i'm really really excited about all of this and i hope you are excited as well now what can we make of these of the sales data mario is popular Newsflash, Mario is popular. Woo! Uh, here's the thing. If you've never played Super Mario 3D World, buy this game. If you're a Mario fan, of course. Buy this game. It is good. It is very good. It's extremely underrated and was overlooked even for many Wii U owners because they didn't want that. They wanted Super Mario Odyssey. They wanted a new massive game they didn't want you know a, a fresh take on a game that originally was like on ds and 3ds they, they wanted they wanted a new open world style mario game uh, and that's not what this is it's stages uh but it's so good 
it is significantly better than Super Mario 3D Land, which is the game I was referencing. So it is amazing. You should play it. It is one of the best Mario games ever made. And yes, Bowser's Fury is a mode. It is a mode that uh, looks to me to be a rather short mode, but it's a really badass mode, right? Like when Bowser pops up and is firing his stuff and the, and the levels are changing a little bit it or, or the world is changing i guess i should say it's, it's kind of one stage one open world stage of multiple islands i think it's so cool you, you get to ride plessy around and have a blast i think it looks absolutely fantastic and as someone who actually 100 percented super mario 3d world on wii u i'm picking the game up i'm picking it up i probably won't get it on amazon uh, I sometimes have issues with Amazon getting me the game the same day. Some people actually get the game early, so it's not actually a problem for a lot of people. But I don't know. For some reason in my area in particular, I don't tend to get the same day. So I'll probably end up you know, going to a local store, which I know, pandemic. Yeah, it is what it is. Uh, GameStop or a Walmart. Walmart, obviously, you can get $10 cheaper. But also, you have to go in person. And also, they have limited copies and in some areas, it's just going to be impossible to get to do that. So, uh, again, we have an affiliate link down in the description. If you, too, uh, want to get this game pre-ordered, ready to go, get it into your thing. Also, by the way, for those wondering, if you talk to a customer service rep at Amazon, they will price match Walmart. I don't know how many people know that or are aware of it, but Walmart can be price matched uh, at Amazon. So, just something... Uh, to take into consideration. Uh, that being said, I am Nathaniel Rumpful Jance from Nintendo Prime. And I want to thank you guys for tuning in. Remind yourselves to enter that giveaway if you haven't. Uh, yes, folks, every single video I release is another chance to get another entry. Obviously, we have our Instagram and everything else you can go follow. I didn't include our Twitch this time. That'll probably be in the next giveaway. I'm already spinning up ideas for that next giveaway. Clearly, it looks like we should probably give away one of those Mario Red Switches, right? Like, duh. <laughs> uh, but that's probably something we might take care of in February. Uh, that is not what t this month's giveaway is. So take that for what you will. I am Nathaniel Rumpeljance, and I will catch each and every single one of you in whatever video I'm doing next.